Hi there, I'm Ellie from Smart Apps for Kids and I'm going to show you a demo of what this app looks like on the inside. When you've seen enough, click this icon at any time during the video to read more about it or to download it from the App Store. Here we go. We're looking inside Jamaroo's musical ABCs today. Now, I know you just heard the word ABCs and thought, yep, there are lots of alphabet apps in the App Store, but this one raises the bar for the others. The start is it's musical, so I'm going to love it anyway. But let me show you what else is in it. We'll press play. And there's an empty stage with some lovely palm trees swaying in the background. Down the bottom is the alphabet, and I'm scrolling along it little alphabet letters with eyes no less and if I tap them Z W U they say T what they are P N M but nothing's happening on the stage R is it nothing at all D well let's pull the letter up and drop it on B Bob the bear plays the banjo oh good on you Bob now did you notice that Bob the bear did not immediately start playing the banjo that's a nice little detail. It means that the parent or the teacher using this with a child can have a discussion about what they're seeing on the screen without it being overwhelmed with music. But having said that, let's listen to Bob play the banjo. Oh, well done, Bob. It was very nice. Now, if I tap him, he'll play his banjo song again. I can tap the words and have them play again. Bob the bear plays the banjo. And, oh, we also like the fact that in each of these sentences there's more than just one word that starts with the letter B. Now, what else can we do? Down the bottom, I can tap any of these little creatures. B, B, B. B is for bird. And they drop down with the word. B is for bird. And four little birds, which we can play with. They have hilarious sound effects. We can stack them to practice our fine motor skills. Ta-da! And then when we tap them, <laughs> it's like your own personal circus of birds. Amazing! So that will happen with any of these that you drop down. B is for B. All right, let's go and B have a look at another B. one. Let's have a look B at is for M. 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 Maggie the monkey plays the mandolin. Oh, Maggie, I love the mandolin. Let's hear you play. That was wonderful. You must have practiced for hours. Now, if you don't know very much about the mandolin, which some people won't know, we can go back, pressing these back arrows, and up here under the music icon, we can find out a little bit about each of the instruments. This is a nice detail. Here we go. Here's the mandolin. It's a string instrument developed in Italy in the 17th century, so there's some history here and a little bit of detail about the actual instrument itself. So here we go. All of the instruments are listed here under the About the Instruments bit. The only thing I'd like to see is this information actually on the screen with the instrument so we could easily access it maybe from the pull-down menu so we can read it as we're looking at the actual instrument. That'd be handy. Oh, Maggie and your mandolin playing. Let's pick P and see what that is. P. Parrot plays the piano. Oh, pal, you play the piano for me. There we go, that wasn't your old hackneyed nursery rhyme version of things, was it? It's nice that these musical excerpts are a bit out of the ordinary, not what you'd always hear. Let's see what the... Oh. P is for pasta. And we can put, 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 stack our pasta. pasta. We can do all sorts of fun things with it. P is for pasta. What's under X? Could they find anything that wasn't X. the xylophone? Oh, Lux, the ox plays the saxophone. Oh, that's cheating. The X is in the middle of the word. But anyway, let's listen to locks. Oh, and at the end of locks, an ox. Good.
Good work, Lox the Ox. That's quite some saxophone playing. All right, let's have a look at one more. What would you like? G? G. Gat the gecko plays the guitar. Okay, Gat. You're very cute. I love geckos. Oh, good work, Gat. Let's have a whole heap of little girls fall g down. So I've got one little girl in my house, girl. that's enough. She never stops talking. G g we can stack these ones. G is for girl. Hi! Hi. G g g Hi. G is for girl. Hi. Hello. Hello. Ready, 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 ready. Uh, there. Hello. 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 Oh, and I can make these girls Hi. go away Hello. as soon as I like. I like my own, g g and I can stack some gorilla. G g g g g Roar. gorillas as well. <laughs> Roar! Did that gorilla just roar at me? <laughs> I think it did. Okay, so here we go. What else have we got? Under the information button, a little bit of information about the makers of Jamaroo's musical ABCs, and under the four parents button, which is locked with uh, something that even I can do, that maths. There's some information about how to get the most out of Jamaroo Musical ABCs and more about it, and all the external links are here. And there we go. There's Jamaroo's Musical ABCs. Lots of cute little animals all playing their own instrument, which they have practiced for hours and hours and hours to bring this wonderful musical app to you. Now don't go without clicking on our Smart Apps for Kids links for great reviews, free apps every single day and the best giveaways.